Microphone check. Microphone check. Ah, here we go. Microphone check. Ah, here we go. Uh, there we go. Ah, okay, good, good, good. I can hear myself now. <clears throat> All right, here we go. Starting to get a more healthily balanced population of human beings. Okay, there's no music playing, but that's just the in-game uh, atmosphere. Uh, nothing's playing right now, but... Okay, chat's working. There we go. Okay, all's good. Now, let's see what we were last doing and figure out what the fuck was going on. Okay, we got three people unemployed. We got four people at the gate there, goddamn. A little bit overkill if you ask me. Hmm, <coughs> excuse me. We got 36 men in the army. Do we really need that many? What happens yeah, if I yes. get rid of some of you? From oh. Hi, Kelima. And yes, yes, I did, did kill five, five bosses, bosses, but, but, no, but, but I still, still... But not, but not without, without resting. resting and, but not, but not, not without, without bonfiring. bonfiring. I did, I did it in one sitting. sitting. Some, Some of those have just pissed, pissed me off way, way too much for you to say, you know, you know what? what, I don't, I don't want, want you to be alive, alive anymore. anymore. Or one, or one of them, of them dead. Collect that meat. The bears are getting vicious. My my boys just got mauled by two fucking bears. But I see one of those bosses I had to kill is a giant, giant bear. bear. <laughs> wow. Two of those were people, people riding, riding on horses. horses. Another, Another one, one was, I think, a beast, beast or, or a humanoid beast. beast. Kind, of kind of like, like a, a werewolf. Der Werewolf. Then, then another, another one, one was a giant. giant. Then the, the last, last one, one was I killed, I killed a giant. giant. Let me take a closer look. Hey. Game? Let me build. Alright, oh, we're introducing economics so we can buy stuff now. We're gonna introduce something called a new dollar. And also, why does it smell like you're playing as Red Talon? Red and also, and also us. Us. If I was Red Talon, Kelima, you'd be getting kidnapped and silenced. And you'd be getting sent to the mines. Sounds about right. right. It's where you're safe, Kelima. You're safe down there. Safe now! So many people definitely, definitely killed, killed themselves, themselves, but who? But, but, but they will be counted as suicides. suicides. I mean, I mean, but. but Oh yeah, uh, yeah, some, some people, people definitely, definitely die, die. Well, they, they will be counted as suicides. suicides. I mean, they, they will, will be counted as suicides. Safe now! How does, How does someone, someone shoot themselves in the head eight, eight times? times? <laughs> <laughs> what, well, like, like I got an, an SMG and it's still on auto, auto mode? mode? Is that how I do it? it? Pile of scrap metal? Ignore it. I've been sending three people damn near every time, but people have just 
Like, we get the resources, but then, like, a percentage of the time somebody, somebody dies. So it's just like, eh. Uh, if I had all of those people right now instead of those resources, where would I be? I'm gonna put the warehouse right here because we're gonna clear out this department store and stuff putting it up here and over here makes no sense because it's too close to two of them already so we're gonna put it on this one right here yeah there we go and then we're gonna build some resource gathering posts switch your boots for slippers marines Do I have to go take you over there? Move! Move! Move. <laughs> exactly. I can, I can imagine that shit. Somebody's like, no, I'm not moving. And, uh, fucking, just, he just gets drop kicked and the dude tries to get back up and he drop kicks him again. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to build this last fence up intentionally so that they can gather the stone from right there. Are we getting gas masks produced now? Because we got the coal for it. <clears throat> Produce plenty of gas masks and then we're going to start making uh, heavy body armor and military helmets. Hmm? What's going on? A merchant has wandered into our camp. Alright, let's deal with you. Let's wheel and deal. Stationary machine gun! G36C, AK-12, drum magazine, M21. Scar? I said, I said my, my computer, computer just locked, locked up. up. We can sell porridge for sixteen dollars a piece. Just eat it yourself. Or does it taste like shit? No, it is good. It's good food. We got like three kitchens full of chefs. I put all the women on gardening and uh, the field kitchen because there's very relatively low accidents that happen in those areas. Also, all of those areas just so happen to be surrounded by military troopers and guard towers. And there's even a police station next to one of them. Oh my god, god that's so... so... <laughs> that's, that's, that's epic. epic. Yeah, no, right? 
Could you imagine on your way to work, you got the fire department, police station, and a military uh, depot right next to where you fucking cook up porridge every day? Yeah. yeah. I, this dynamite, if we sell this, we can get so many dollars, but I don't know what I'm gonna do with those dollars, so I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna fucking chill, you know? I'm just gonna chill the fuck out. Our men are getting injured, but they're living through the injuries. That's uh, that's the power of body armor right there. Also, I discovered that we can skip laws. Like, we don't have to go top down. I thought that we had to go like that. I'm glad that I haven't wasted any of my shit passing laws that I don't want anymore. And I should have gotten this way sooner. Good conditions. <clears throat> Police get a bonus to all stats. Nice! Soldiers get more experience. Soldiers gain increased health. Ooh, that'd be very handy. Especially surviving uh, amounts of damage that we wouldn't be able to normally survive. Max HP, I'm a big fucking fan of it in every game. Max HP helps against every form of damage. Flat damage... High damage, low damage, poison damage, fire damage, damage over time, damage that stacks on top of damage. Damage, damage, damage. Yeah, even healing that heals you for a percentage. Being able to survive what comes your way is the most important thing. It don't matter what you dish out. If you can't take it, you ain't, you're dead when they come back to swing because, you know, you can't dodge and avoid everything, all right? Some of that shit you got to take on the chin. That's why you need that max HP. Aimed shooting. Increase well, soldiers. Mean, you know, every every in, every in, in every RP, in every game. game. Um, aimed shooting sounds like it's really good. I, I'm really uh, leering on adopting lots of laws that enhance our soldiers. <laughs> aimed shooting seems like a good choice. Every situation, they need to hit their shots. No matter uh, like if they miss their shots, which they do a lot, like missing less shots saves us a lot of money, economy, everything. We're on the green game for food, so we can chill in that respect for a little bit. Can we build multiple prisons or only one? Okay, we can only build one. Wow, it covers all of those cars. Oh, 
we're expanding the settlement outwards a bit. <laughs> Okay, everybody's got employment. We got Jonathan White. Jose Johnson. And look, we got 10 pieces of porridge. Come and get it, people. Only five people are hungry? I got, like, three kitchens now, so that's enough to, like, really start actually cooking the food so we can get our value out of the food. We got one, two, three good functioning sawmills. We should get a fourth sawmill. So it reaches to about this tree here. There we go. Jesus. If I didn't tell him to run away, he'd be fucking dead right now. Jesus. Shall be done. Perhaps. 
<clears throat> Alright, so we got like 150 something people. I'm gonna make one more medical tent. Because for every like 40 people or so, you know, we can hold like three, but if only six people get sick or injured, which, like, we've got 35 soldiers, yeah, they would not be able to handle all that. Uh, we'll make a hospital tent, uh... Right here. We want to spread out the hospitals a little bit. We don't want them all in one spot because it might be a long distance to run to get to the hospital. We want to spread them out a little bit. Tactically. I ain't going to go through the trouble of tearing this one down because uh, that, that takes labor and time. Ain't nobody about to do that shit. Give me them electronics. Give me that wood. Okay, 16 hours, we're gonna have a piece of research done, so then we'll need to get piggies from the merchant, merchant shop. Go. Let's get a second farm up since we're researching economics. Uh, excuse me. Hmm? Oh my gosh. Save the game. Let's go to the map and see what's going on. I have to remember to not pause it before I go to the map. Miles Miller?
Yes. On my way. going on? Why is production of our gas mask stopped? Okay, we got economics done, so we're ready to introduce the new dollar. Cargo vehicles, production of vans. should I research? Greenhouse 3? Stationary machine guns that can be mounted on fortifications, vehicles, and armored vehicles. Ooh, okay. Armored personnel carrier. The production of an army tank? What? We can get fucking tanks? I guess we'll upgrade our production efficiency because we plan on producing a lot.
And then once our efficiency is up, then we'll start researching different kinds of ammos and ammo types and shit like that. Maybe ammo, uh, the ability to produce our own machine gun ammo. Merchant's shop. Alright, we don't need you on this sawmill, we need you building this. Gather the settlers. A weapon left in the gun shop? Nope. Unless we're sending soldiers? No, thank you. So this will be the merchant shop, and then we've got to get people on these farms. Is there anything else that we need them to build right now? Oh, staffing for the medical <laughs>
Factory. Temperature minus 50. So why is it stopping production? I don't understand why. Give me my fucking thingies. Is it because the efficiency is too high so I gotta change it? Like what? Damn, people are freezing. Here we go, this ought to give me more people. We only need like a skeleton crew on these gates. Since they mostly will just function as a watchtower for now.
okay, but how do I buy pigs? Keep it on a skeleton crew, basically. A messenger from Colonel Madison has arrived. He's led. He has led gang units under his command and they've presented us with the ultimatum. 100 kilograms of provisions or war. Fuck you! Nobody takes our shit! Squad, form and attack the formation. Just gonna save just before this fight. No reason, just in case I accidentally, you know, click the map, right? Light his ass up. Double up the guards on every gate.
there some food on the ground there? Yes. Yes, sir. Oh, I think it's because the efficiency reaches its maximum, so we have to restart production again. I think I get it. But shouldn't it just keep going? I don't know. We're about to de we've declared war, so it's time to switch to production of armor. here. Food two kilometers away from our camp? Nope. Not worth anybody dying. Start producing that helmets and body armor. I'm ready. Cash. Hey, hey. We got money. We also got porridge. Whoa! Everybody's just like fucking buying up their. Oh, you... Yo! People, chill, chill, chill. There, we got porridge. We got porridge. Chill. Chill. Oh my god. Alright, when people are not as hungry, I'll uh, bring everybody into the church. Oh my god. Why did they leave their posts? Get ready. Yeah. What the fuck? Reloading. I'm ready. This is so fucking oh god. It leaves you so open every time that they...
him. Are you, are you guys fucking brain dead? What the hell is wrong with you? Just lost a person because of that. Like every, all of the military is just like, I'm gone. Fuck it. And somebody died. It's so fucking annoying. The fucking chaotic, unpredictable pattern of. And like, what are you doing? Why are you here? Why are you just guarding the kitchen? No! Go back to your fucking post. Jesus Christ, man. I swear, some of the challenge of this fucking game is just realizing, just understanding or being able to tell whether or not your characters are just being fucking idiots. Or if they're going to be. Why is every fucking settlement hostile? Every settlement is submit or I kill you. Like, nobody's like, hey, let's trade. Except for the one singular merchant. But everybody else is like, I'll kill you! I guess that's why it's an apocalypse, huh? I suppose, I suppose the real apocalypse is people, people going ape shit. shit. Yeah, I guess. Bro, everybody's hungry and they're just like, yes. I will spend them new dollars. Look. What the fuck you got new dollars? You sure you're all running in the, the cult? cult? But everybody in the fucking settlement wants that new merchant shop food. They used to just go to the warehouse to eat, but now it's like, let's go to the fucking shop.
I figured out why my uh, factory wasn't like producing anymore. It's not because it ran out of wood. It's not because it ran out of coal or anything. It's because once it reaches maximum production, then you gotta switch it off and then switch it back to something else. And you'd think that it's because it ramps up over time, you'd want to just leave it and let it produce, right? No. Once it reaches maximum production efficiency, you just have to stop, turn it off, turn it back on. And it's like, why? Why don't you tell me that? Sure, sure it is You know what, just because everybody's so fucking... Just to save them some travel time, I'm probably gonna fucking build another merchant shop right here. Just so they don't gotta go so damn far. Did I already save? I don't know. There. Saved. I'm gonna look at the map. Colonel Madison's army. Fuck you, Colonel Madison. Eat a dick. Oh my god, I thought I just re my game just got completely reset. Also, it just said 8 hours, but it's actually 17. Okay. Depending on which direction they come from, I'll use the church to evacuate the town. <laughs> Feel the full might of our military force. Everybody on fucking long burst. An efficient enemy squad, huh? Boy. The only efficient thing you about to get is this dick in your face. That's what you gonna get, son. <laughs> Hey, did you see the first video, Kelma? Or, you know, you were there when, uh, yeah. fucking, uh, Carson. 
Carson Stewart when he was like, I'm gonna fuck some shit up. Yeah. It was so good. The uh, My favorite part is when he started fucking laughing. Bro, y'all not even trying to hunt the animals for meat at this point. You're just fucking killing them. What do you mean, hunger in the settlement? We got uh, so much fucking food. Also, why is my food depleting so rapidly? Why is everybody getting hungry so fast? Did this happen on purpose just to force this event to trigger? Ready. Oh my god, they have an RPG. Carson, get in there! Back up, back up, back up, back up! Get back, get back! Hold the line! Shoot him down! Get to the medical tent, get to the medical tent! Yes! 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 Alright, tend to the wounded. Carson, get in there and retrieve the what's left. Ready. 
Holy fuck, that was a war that just went off. Well, Mr. General. Anybody else think it's about time we won on the offensive? Yes, sir. RPG? Yes. Production efficiency, electricity. Research in progress. Get ready. On my way. Yeah. <laughs> That church is super useful. You can just get everybody out. Get ready. Ready. Yeah. Block up one hole up. Bro, you can get anything that's better than a clock. Get you a deagle. I'm ready. <laughs> Is that a cross? Grayson Diaz. Get ready. Liam Cook. Okay. You there? <laughs> New refugees? Yes. I'm ready. What are we doing here? Small group of survivors, send three. Okay, what they got here? They got three women. Staff the hospital, staff the kitchen.
resource station, staff that up. Greenhouse, yes. Get two of you on that fortified gate. resource station saving because I'm about to check the map <laughs> Colonel Madison you about to meet your end Colonel Madison Hey, uh, do you know how to get pigs, Skelma? Go to the farm! Huh? Yeah, 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 farm. Yeah, I'm at my farm. I said, I said someone else's farm. farm. We need to have a pig. pig. I don't, I don't know, know I've never played this game. game. Oh. I never see these in my life. Oh, I'm slow it down on the military growth. We need to get some more uh, food growth going on. Yeah, like we have no pigs. What does it say in the fucking research? Farm. You can buy pigs from merchants, so I need to wait until a merchant comes by to the city, I guess. Maybe. I think that's what it might be.
Okay, that's done. Now we got ten people that are unemployed. We'll increase our soldiers' accuracy with our laws. Fucking RPG. <laughs> Accuracy, negative 20. Okay, what do we need right now? Do we need more greenhouses? Uh, I guess we could use one more because we just got more settlers. Every time we get more settlers, we get another greenhouse. Dismantle that fucking building. We don't need it anymore. Yeah, there's like 20 food there, but you know what? It's not blocking anything. So, yeah, it's time to get rid of that. Time to get rid of that, too. <laughs> now we got 14 people that are unemployed. Back down to a skeleton crew on every gate. There we go. Now we've got lots of labor available. And now we can get some shit really built. You know what? Because of the large workload of what the factory demands. Let's build another one. Hospital, shack, house. Let's get that coal production booming as well. <laughs> some housing going here as well. 
get a medical tent over here too. all of this uh, shit being produced we need some more greenhouses you got a house you got a garden next to it Um, greenhouse. Yes, but where? That's a good spot. Right next to the damn warehouse. And kitchen. From farm to table. Alright, this ought to do it. As soon as they finish up with this stone right here, we'll uh, pack this stone crusher up and go. Nobody's equipped that RPG, and I'm very fucking glad of it. And if I notice that bitch go missing, I, we, uh... Excuse me? Okay, good, thank god. I thought the fucking rocket launcher disappeared for a second there. Went into a panic for a second.
one factory by itself ain't producing helmets fast enough, so we need another one. How do we not- how are you not shooting that boar? Dude. Yes, sir. There. I gotta fucking make him climb up. Search group successfully returned, and we found three people. Hell yes. to find labor for these other four people. Let's look at our economics. Food. Spent 526. Gained. Hmm. Should I put a few of you on food production? My food says minus 14 right now. We gotta really bump that up. It'd be nice if I was able to see like how much I was getting every day of each of the things. Factory, coal, kitchen, hunting. Thank <laughs> you. 
Nice ammo. Okay. Of course. Roger. Yeah. Are you hiccuping? No. I'm not saying something. Elevate to message to people. You're hiccuping. <laughs> I haven't even anything, anything at all, so why don't we start hiccuping, hiccuping right, right now? Because that's what your body deems the most inconvenient possible thing to do, so that's what's gonna happen. Event. Pile of metal scrap. Don't give a fuck about it. We got a big pile of metal scrap right here, rough, <laughs> right in front of us. Can you actually go into the fucking guard tower, please? No. no. There you go. Motherfucker just stand behind it like a dumbass. Only three stone left and we can finish up this hole in the fence here. Uh, 
One produces helmet, one produces body armor. Okay, Greenhouse 3. Repair vehicles. Getting that technical could be very good, but I don't really want to. They got rocket launchers. They blow our fucking car up. Light army vehicles. Now that might be able to take a rocket. The APC, a hundred percent sure, it can. And if it can't, it's not an APC. Light army vehicles. Or we prepare for even colder winter. Well, we got electricity studied, so that's good. Let's get some vehicles going. I'm gonna save before I check the fucking map. Why does the time keep going up every time I exit and re-enter the map?
We're running out. We're running out of gas, man. Thirty, they send seven troops to attack our pile of thirty. Which one do you think is going to win, Caliber? What? What's what happening? Mean? They're sending seven troops to attack me, and I have thirty. Yeah. yeah. Why, Why the, the fuck, fuck is someone, someone sending, sending troops, troops after you? you? I think, I think you, should you should send troops after, after that, well, that they, guy. They uh, they declared war. Because they came over here, demanded that we supply them with 100 kilograms worth of items and food. I told them that they can go beat their dicks to porno magazines. They're not stealing any of our fucking people. They didn't really like that very much. So then... Well... I politely told them no by shooting them in the face and then stealing their rocket launcher. Okay, okay that's, that's fair enough. enough. What? They started it. Yeah, yeah that's, that's a, a, that's a, that's a, that's a response. response. Yes. Yes, it is. Fair, Fair enough, enough. If people, people are just going to go 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 Look, if they come in, push us around one time, they'll come back and do it again. I can't, I can't imagine that people, people are just insane, insane and still okay. okay. They are. Uh, they used to be, but in a different way. They usually just get angry and become hostile, and nev they just send you veils well, well, on the radio, well, but never actually... Quit eating gas masks. Yes, they're fucking <laughs> consuming, like, gas masks. I'm almost out. Well, well, they just they just up to your house and start shooting you in the face? Pretty much. Oh, oh this is stupid. stupid. In the state of decay. They didn't do that in state of decay. It'd be nice if they actually did, because it'd feel like they were some sort of threat. Exactly. And then eventually a mission will pop up where they're just gonna die. It keeps delaying the enemy squad from coming in every time I go into the fire. Just for them to die. Isn't that strange? Making these super heavy armors. Nothing is more valuable than the lives of our soldiers. And citizens. But we don't really put body armor on the citizens. We put it on our soldiers. Ready. Ready. On my way.
got Colt 1911s, got Beretta 92Fs. Yo, every time there's any kind of fucking food, they just they just come and buy that shit up. Also, there are no more merchants coming. It's been a while since we've seen them. I mean, like, I want to get those farms up and running so we can get the the meat from the pigs and shit. But we can't get none. It's fucking bullshit. Yes. Oh, piggy, 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 piggy. Oh, oh my god. Okay, what about our ammo supply? How's that? Ammo 2. FNFAL STATIONARY MACHINE oh! Okay, let's sell all of our old armor. And helmets. H. Heckler and Koch 433. It'd be nice if I could see the stats of these weapons. This uses ammo 3, ammo 3. Yeah, you know what? That'll help us get a lot of food. But what we need right now is guns! And we need quantity over quality. Because we're looking to equip a volume of soldiers here, as opposed to quality of equipment. Because four soldiers armed uh, decently is better than one soldier armed poorly. Or, like, super well. I mean, I, that's not the case for our fucking superhero, but it was more like every other soldier was armed with fucking shit weapons and this dude had a god tier gun. That said, this is gonna save us some time. So wait, how much did all four piglets cost? 450 for one piglet, okay. I'm sad that these piglets weren't in the game, uh, like, I had to figure out it was this merchant and not the other merchant, which is sort of annoying.
Herbs? Oh yeah, you use those to heal up and shit. You know what? Let's trade. Let's be crazy for a second. Oh, wait. Yeah, let's be crazy for a second. And let's take all of this food and trade it for... Nah. That's retarded. We're going to give you, put back some of that porridge. You know, let, we can save some of this for next time. Some of that. Keep some of our cash. This will save us a little bit of production time. Oh, we can't, uh, okay, I get it. We can't buy more than a certain amount. Okay, ammo type number three. We need some of that. No, because we got we invented currency, we get back our change. Right. So I think before that happened. Oh no no no! They didn't come yet, did they? Oh, for fuck's sake. Did I just... Did I pause the oh, time before I... Where's the button? Oh, god damn it. Alright, fuck it. I'm just... I, I saved, so I know that... I gotta remember to always... I'm glad that I remembered to save every fucking time. Oh, uh, now I gotta dra fight to drag the fucking screen.
No! Um... Okay, this is good enough. Now let me make sure it's fucking resized in the stream properly. Perfect. It's visible. Okay, I got two unemployed people. Oh, I didn't notice the ammo underneath that tree. I'll remember that. Piggies? Is that inventory? Eat a pig? What? Did they eat a whole ass pig? pig? Everybody, get into the church! Cancel all work! Cancel all work! All military personnel report to the east side! Somewhere for the doctors to live. We believe in you, Mr. Stewart.
Move up and attack Carson. Back up, back up, back up, back up, back up, back up. Taking a hit, back up. Open fire! Chase him down! Get his ass, Carson! Yeah! Now there was a piece of ammo that was all the way on the left side of the Let's fucking move. map. It shall be done. Let's move. Of course. Sure. Let's move. Roger. Repair and service point. Somewhere to park our vehicles would be nice. We got kind of a factory and production looking kind of place going on here, so I don't think it'd be too far fetched to get a vehicle repair house over there.
got that ammo. On my way. Alright, military gathering. Military gathering. Military gathering. Call in every unit. We need to get everybody back, sorted, organized. Waiting. I'm ready. On my way. Orders. Of course. Get ready. It shall be done. Ready! Yeah. Sure, 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 I'm sure, you sure, 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 Oh, oh, that's gonna be a very bad time. Ah, oh, all of those are commonly used skills. Darkest Dungeon 2. Occultist, <laughs> Occultist Man-at-Arms, Envious. Occultist Leper, Resentful. Occultist Grave Robber, Hateful. Envious, Resentfulness, and Hatefulness. Damn. And then the next end, they're all amorous with one another. It's just like, oh my god. I'm glad that we got everything out. The sexual tension was just that intense, you know? <laughs> what what are you what 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 the the of an amorous relationship? relationship? Oh my god. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this this is this is why. This is why you don't do drugs. <laughs> when you say fuck you to relationships, oh, oh my fucking god, I actually didn't give a shit about my characters. Bro, I, yeah, Darkest Dungeon 2, you have to prior, you have to. What is this? Generates electricity. Necessary research, electricity. Thermal power plant! <laughs> Allows you to convert heat into electricity. Transformer. Allows you to branch. Ball with your enemy chores on every time she beats Addis. Ball with your enemy chores every time she self reflects. Interesting. Ball with your enemy chores every time she self reflects. Interesting. Okay, so I don't understand how to use this electricity yet, but I'm gonna take <laughs> aim shooting. Yes. I'm gonna adapt, adopt that. You know, the first law that you should adopt should probably be this one. Good conditions. It's really good. Either that or, like, skillful doctors. I didn't know that you could get any of them that you wanted. Any order. So cool. I'll be right back in just a minute, though. I'm gonna take a very, very short biological break. So what am I... Let me, let me put up the transition. There you go. Be right back.
back uh get my headphones in you still there kelma yeah of course i am what are you doing on elden ring huh i'm not even on elden ring oh i thought you were still on elden ring if it is showing that on steam it's probably because my computer computer's locked up, up and, and it doesn't, doesn't seem to be wanting to not be locked up, up. i wasn't even checking. I just, I just assumed that you were. That was the last thing I knew that you were doing. So I was like, okay. Man, I, I this will probably be the first thing that I adopt. Damn near every game, more accurate shooting on soldiers. That's fucking pog cam.
uh, just getting myself wrapped up in my blankets because it's cold as shit. Um, accelerates construction defense structures. Soldiers gain increased health. I want that. Settlers move faster. Hmm, increases stability gain from church. Settlers deal more damage, civil defense. Okay, I... <laughs> we were ordering guys to go to different places. We have not ordered anybody to go. Okay, body armor still being produced. Ready. Maverick, I need you to go here. Ian, go there. Liam, right there. Landon Johnson, right there. Oh yeah, what did we just research? Right, we need to get a cargo vehicle repair pool uh, servicing spot up and running. Allows you to introduce the right ideas to citizens, raising their morale. Creates detachment that monitors the order in the settlement. Oh, that's a big building. Oh, and it's got to be somewhere that we can drive our cars into. Nice and spacious, like right here. Fuck! Like right here. Oh my gosh. It's so much space needed. It's so... much space. I mean, we could put it right here, but this is such an unwieldy spot. Um, that's an unwieldy spot, too. Fuck! Where can I put it? I mean, we gotta move that hospital out the way. I didn't, I didn't know we could build buildings this fucking big. I mean, we could put it down here, but that's not good either. Tell you what, a car can probably make it through one of these spaces. So, right about, no. No, because we need somewhere that's easy to access for the vehicles. 
Ah, damn. Can we just have a soldier just like throw a grenade right here and just fucking clear this spot? Oh, we don't have any more grenades, do we? Oh, shit. We'll send barracks number one where we need to go. I'm ready. Orders. Waiting. Get ready. Ready. <coughs> Fuck, man. Um... I, I suppose it's possible for cars to reach this spot right here. They just gotta take the road, come around, and go in. And while it's not the best spot I have, Pretty much the only spot I have, but uh, the question is, can a fucking tank and an APC fit in there? I think not. I did it right. Well, here's the problem. You see how big this building is? It needs to be able to fit a vehicle in there, is what I'm thinking. See, like, that. Like that. Yeah. And I want to put it right here, or somewhere that I can, like, come off of the road. Uh, there's no way around it. I'm going to have to move something, or... Let's set up another hospital, but the other, the, the next hospital will be right here next to uh, the prison and the headquarters. And I'll remove this hospital and... Oh no, I can't remove that hospital. Shit. Because there's all these fucking tree stumps right here. I can't put it down. Damn it.
Yeah, there's all these fucking tree stumps everywhere. That's what makes it difficult to build this big ass auto shop. Maybe right here? But then that blocks the fucking gate. Damn. Why does this have to be so hard? Like, fucking over here, or...? There's a pile of fucking coal right there. Hmm. <clears throat> Wow. It's possible to build it like right here. Can we drive into that? It looks like we can. This might be the spot. I literally can't see anywhere else that's even remotely fucking reasonable. We just might have to make that fucking power line a piece of this house, you know? Um, we gotta find somewhere to employ this last guy. Maybe a resource station to help pick apart some of these fucking cars. Excuse me. Resource station. Game? Let me fucking build! go
finally patched up that hole in the fucking fence. That farm only has one piglet. This one's got three. Oh shit, we're gonna need some more gas masks, aren't we? Next round that either factory finishes, we're gonna go on double production for gas masks. Hammer that shit out. Cargo vehicle. to the guy who was gonna attack me did we just kill him or did, we just... did we just kill him and it just didn't happen or what I said, I said someone, someone else probably, probably has done the job for you. you maybe they all got fucked up by bears I bet the the one one so I, I can't, can't really be surprised when someone, someone else killed, killed the guy who was, who was attacking, attacking you. you. Bro. Bears are mm. fucking deadly. Also, guys! Everybody left the military barracks and they just like, Hey, yo, 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 you got some corn dogs? Hey, I want some of that pig meat. Hey, brother, I need myself a fucking cheeseburger. And the merchant's just like, bro! I work harder than everybody else in this fucking city put together. I gotta feed 150 people. Meanwhile, the ladies in the kitchen making their fucking porridge, they're just like, am I a joke to you? <laughs> I've been feeding you all the way for three months, and you just want to go to this fucking hussy's merchant shop? And the dude's like, but I'm a dude. You're still a fucking hussy. Just throws fucking porridge at him.
breaking apart pieces of the fence and everything. Can you guys get specifically these last couple of pieces, please? I want to see what happens if we try to get this building right here. Yes. 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 Come on. Oh, here we go. Small group of survivors? Send everybody to get them. Send a fucking military detachment to fucking rescue them. Barracks number one is our most hardened military veteran troopers. The finest. Uh, look at them. They're all like, turn up. Electrical panel installation. I noticed that when I open the map, it changes the amount of time, so I think that's what happened to the last group. Maybe they got lost in time and space, because I kept opening the fucking map. Wait, wait what? <laughs> I just read that in the chat. Kelly, what, what the fuck are you talking about? Oh. Barracks one, handle this. Send in the hardened soldiers. Everybody else hold the perimeter. Back up, Jack. Oh my god. Right. 
Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. His body just went flying. Look, you can see. Oh my god. Did you see the fucking shadow? <laughs> Did you see the shadow? The shadow of that dude's body went flying. Report back to base, everybody, except you. Get ready. Okay. Yes. RPG rocket. You. Search the bodies. These guys blew up some metal walls uh, with them rockets and shit. Why does it say that they're diseased when they got shot? It's like, oh no, I've caught fucking lead bullet disease. Ten hours for just a truck? Damn. Unloading station.
That looks like a perfect spot. Ready. Let's move. Get in that car, Ezekiel. Let's fix that thing up. Refugees? Ah, that's the people we sent them to get rescued earlier. repair. What? I thought that I could fix that. Maybe I was wrong. Did I do it wrong? Ready. Oh, they seem to be fixing it. Oh, here we go. It'd be nice if they just had a little thing that just says, cars parked near here automatically get fixed. is an event
I don't really understand how electricity works at all. Gravity accumulator? Where's the tutorials? Let's build up until we have the ability to take out those people trying to fucking terrorize us. These guys have special permission to pursue enemies in barracks number one. Masicate Ogni Speranza Boy Chitrante.
I don't know what that means, but I mean it means something. Gates closed, but they just walk through the fucking side. I knew I should have built that fence better. How do they keep getting guys to be able to send to attack us? We made like 30 gas masks, so we are good.
Baby Carson instructing his men. His third and fourth in command. So all of these events going off. Small group of survivors? Yes. Listen up, man. We have an enemy that has caused terror to our settlement. We will seek out, search, and destroy their entire civilization. We will leave none standing, for we have to nip this in the bud. It cannot be believed that people can treat others in this fashion and manner. We have to show them the world, set an example of what we do to savages. Do I hear you, Marines? Now, when they show up, make sure you switch your boots for slippers, because it's gonna be practically a holiday. <laughs> they are nothing like the first enemy attachment that they sent us. They lost their most veteran units, their most prized possessions, their most elite soldiers. They have sent nothing but cannon fodder to our gates repeatedly, over and over. These enemies have been willing to throw away their lives and livelihoods. Men, women, children, soldiers and outlaws, they don't care what they send. There's a zombie.
Wait, we just had three men die? Holy fuck! <laughs> How the hell die? Are the wildlife getting super fucking strong or something? This dude had an AK, though. What? Oh, they were hunters. That doesn't explain how the third one died. Yeah, eaten by an animal. One of the residents asks to let him go in search of his dog. No. That's the same thing as taking a death. Church bell. Waiting. Sure. Yeah. I'm ready. Let's move. Of course. It shall be done. <laughs> Get ready. Yeah. On my way. Got his ass. Okay. Get ready. Sure. 
This dude had a fucking rocket launcher. He was gonna try to sneak him in and blow up the church. This is why you use the church and fucking evacuate everybody. We got a perimeter set up again. Right, that plugs up that hole in the fence. It is dizzying trying to get this wall to shape up the way that I want it to. We'll just have to do that for now. <laughs> uh. 
Uh, excuse me. Oh, uh, you know what? There was a piece of ammo that was like behind one of these trees a long ass time ago. I wonder if it's still there. I don't see it. Okay, as soon as this finishes, we'll double down on producing body armor, get that APC, and roll through this shit. Oh, 
We have a hundred law points. What can we get? Yeah, let's trade, Mr. Merchant. You got some piggies, huh? FNFAL. Why not? Whoa. Alright, sell those old helmets. We're buying more FNFALs, which is very good for us. Hmm. <coughs>
We don't even need the APC yet. We're probably just gonna raid their shit. Yeah, let's raid their shit. This better not be- this better be like a thing where I, I, I get to control the fighting going on. And not just- oh! Text event. All six of your people died because he's invincible. Haha. -ha. Send in eight soldiers. Is there anything, any laws that we can pass to make our soldiers stronger just as this happens? Reduces con coal consumption for buildings. We'll research the propaganda center. Why not? We're gonna wait to buy something like military training. Soldiers get more health.
Now, is it possible to leave? Oh, retreat. Yes. Wait. I'm ready. Okay. Let's move. Roger. On my way. Okay. I'm ready. No. Oh, my God. I wanted them to stop and shoot, but they were just like... Staring at the wall, doing nothing. Let's try this again. What do you mean we don't have a car? We got a fucking car right here. Ready. Ready. On my highway. I hate it how you can't choose who you want to send out either. It's just like it's automatic. And I know eventually the game will get to the point where you just don't care. Okay, how about now? We have to have somebody sitting physically inside the vehicle. Got it.
40 food rations. Give him like... 42 gas. 500 ammo of that. 500 ammo of that. Hundred and seventy eight ammo of that. Maybe two hundred. Okay, we are on the battle group. We are uh, we're awaiting orders. Set those so we can have a pile of body armor when we come back. All right, let's try this again. You guys fucking stupid, get away from there! Uh, listen to my fucking orders when I tell you to move! The fucking truck!
No, you idiot! Jesus fucking Christ! Stop standing still in the open! What are you doing? Charging at them! Oh my god! <laughs> what the fuck's going on? Take cover behind the wall. <laughs> it charges out and <laughs> open. Jesus fucking Christ, man! I, uh, the fucking pause doesn't help. And then when you tell them to run away, they just stand there. <laughs> like, you have to pause the game, issue commands, hope that they follow it, and then just wait, I guess. Oh my god, people are fucking stupid. You fucking idiot! Are you fucking stupid? Move! Oh yes! my god! <laughs> what are you doing? And why are you all the way up there by yourself? What the fuck is so idiot? He's just like, I'm gonna charge forward. Bruh! This is not how you fight wars! Oh my god. Hold on. I know what it is. It's because auto pursuit of enemies gets turned back on. So all the fucking settings that you had to tell them to stop being fucking retarded stays. So they, they just leave cover and then they charge out in the open by themselves, one at a time. Can't even fucking choose who I want to send out, so I can't even send out the best arm players. I just have to click on this and hope the fucking foreskin-headed dumbasses decide that they're smart enough to actually... Send out my well-armed people. And what do you want with this fucking event now? I don't care about the food. Make a raid. Oh, right. We don't own the vehicle because there's nobody specifically sitting inside of it. Like, fucking Carson Stewart, I want him to have good body armor, but he refuses to put it on. Like, where's the micromanagement in this game? And it's not like I can order a person to take it off, because they won't do it. Fuck, man. It's like, the, they, the want, they want the systems of this game, they want you to have to feel like you're struggling. But they want to make the AI retarded, so that way there's some sort of fucking tension. So you're, so you're struggling, struggling against, against the AI. AI. Sounds, Sounds about right. right. It, they fucking charged out in the open! Against a bunch of snipers, and then separated. And then the ones that were hiding behind cover would wait until the other guys died to come the fuck out. Bro, Bro, what, what the, the fuck? fuck?
what a what funny, funny last, last name, name this guy, guy has. has. Salamanica. <laughs> Get in the car. Is this car full or what? what? Get in the fucking car! What's with the weird ass delay? Is is he resisting the command because he he's hungry, so he's canceling the command repeatedly? I, I don't fucking know. know. Let me see. see. There. Get in the fucking car so I can use it. Is it because somebody's inside of this car? Get in the car! Oh my god! Please get in the fucking car. Okay, let's try this again.
can't command both vehicles at the same time. On our way. What the fuck are you doing? You're hurt. Go back. Yes, sir. I'm ready. Get ready. Yeah. Waiting. I'm ready. Ready. Waiting. When they shoot, these guys are mostly like, hey, let me finish the rest of this whole mag first. No! That enemy pursuit shit gotta turn it off. I almost forgot. And it almost ruined this attempt on it. I'm willing to accept a couple deaths, but, like... I, I'm not... I'm not, I, I'm not taking a fucking grenade. That's bullshit. I'm just shot that a repulsive I did just took up half of Boss's health. Yes, sir. Get ready. Yep. 
inching all of them forward one at a time because if you make them group together, then uh, he's basically fucking dead on his feet. You want them to inch forward just barely enough to start shooting? I almost think that this would work better if they just made it fucking turn-based. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's what I feel. feel. If this was an X I'm sure, sure you would have already lost. lost. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Matt, the fact that I'm moving like this, this is how you move in XCOM, so... No. And also, I did Legendary Iron Man on XCOM as well. Uh, inventory. SSG 3000. I think that that might be a sniper rifle. <clears throat> it's definitely not a shotgun, that's for sure.
I'm glad that they don't get hungry, so it does mean that I can take as much time as I need to. got the vehicles ready to get the uh, injured. SVD, that's definitely a sniper rifle. That's a Dragonov. How many soldiers did we kill so far? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We killed about seven of them. We made it past their fortifications as well. Can we rescue these people or something? It shows that we're not here to murder the shit out of everybody, because if we were, it would have had more caps in the ass than... We got the location of one enemy revealed. What the fuck are you doing, rookie? Carson, what the fuck are you doing? I'm ready. I'm ready. Ready. Get ready. Get ready.
What are you doing? Get the fuck back. Sit the fuck down. All of you, sit the fuck down. You. Go here. And then sit the fuck down. We gotta do like 8v1. Hill box up ahead. Let's move. I'm ready. Get ready. Wait. I'm ready. Ready. Get ready. Ah, uh, no. No! Look how, how much I have to find control them to get them to move together as a group and pounce on an enemy all at the same time. It's retarded. I'm gonna have to make these dudes lay the fuck down because they'll, they'll keep squirming around. They won't uh, move and shoot at the same time. So if they're not specifically standing still,
Imagine playing XCOM like this, exactly how I'm doing it. Yeah, yeah I, I can, can imagine, imagine. And, 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 and having, having to lose, lose all those people, people you mentioned. mentioned. Okay. Nobody's dead yet on this op, so it hasn't gone tits up yet. Damage 40, accuracy 30. That's not that bad. But look what happens when you try to move them like this. They spread out. Like that, and then they just start doing dumb shit like moving that way by themselves. What are you doing? I can't see in there. What are you doing? Go back! It's like, spread out, spread out! No, motherfucker, crunch together. I love how this dude kept sending like infinite stacks of eight guys. And he's only got 20 guys in his fort. We've killed him like four or five times now. See? Look at this. No. No. Bad. No. no. You gotta move them one at a time or they they will not move how you like. They move like a, in a, like, a trifecta kind of pattern. Yes. Injured, 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 and then the dude who's driving the car is gravely fucking wounded. I would use more guys, but it's, it's, the more guys you use at once, the harder it is. But the more guys you have, the more firepower you got. It's just that if you try to select them all at the same time, they spread out. And then when you're telling them to run away, they will stop, stay there, and then keep shooting. Alright, you loot.
Yeah, I have to be careful about telling them to run too far because they will. Uh, they'll keep running and they won't shoot. Which I like that for zombies. It's not very good for humans, though. With humans, you want them to stop and stand still as as quickly as possible. Did we clear the place? Yeah, that's the little that's a battlefield limit right there. I think I killed everything. That wasn't 20 soldiers though. I guess I can go back to normal speed now. I didn't grab the loot early on because I was like, oh no. It's a big ass bag of potato chips in there. What? what? No. no. I, wish I wish I did, I did but I don't. don't. Well, no, nah, I see one on the counter right here, on the countertop. Some bottles of soda to go with it. Classy. classy. Very classy. I can't pick up the ammo that's inside the tower. We just stole so many fucking guns. M14, SVD, Bars 1, G36, 
G36K, that one's from Rainbow Six Siege. Famas, that one's from Rainbow Six Siege as well. Oh! They got a fucking army truck. Alright, who's one of our most wounded? You don't even have body armor. Take that truck. You go back and grab the van. We go in with two cars, we come back out with three. I knew we could do this shit, it was just like, oh god. I needed to not fucking trust the AI and like, manually control. how far they spread out when you do this. I take the settlers. Is there a way to know? Um, guide? Production methods, metals, polymers.
let's see if uh, maybe somewhere else says <laughs> something. I don't see any buttons or commands. Uh, raids general discussion. By killing opponents on the global map, you reduce their number and they begin to attack you less often. Easier said than done. Most of the settlements near me are all red and very hard, with far more soldiers than I have set up a defensive position. Oh my god, somebody else has my same pain. This is back in August of 2022. Uh, by killing enemies on the global map, you reduce their number and they begin to attack you less often. And it says, uh, somebody said, uh, a few grenades later, all eight of my guys were dead. Uh, guess what happened to some of my guys? I probably would have been able to push through that, but it was just really fucking annoying that they were just... They were being just crazy and stupid. Uh, they normally don't seem too many men. Uh, at least early on, but try taking out the base. It's not a chance. Uh, if you... Oh, they tend to not follow where you told them to stand and... If you turn off pursue enemies, they won't even fire back. Oh, God. Um, there doesn't seem to be any discussion about if you can take their people. Um, it's talking about all, every other game other than The Last Haven. So, information on this game seems to be very, uh, well... Not great. Music and battle mode. Fixed collision for restored houses. Women can now work in the sawmill and quarry. Oh. I didn't know that they couldn't work in the sawmill and quarry before. I didn't really often send them into that, but uh, that makes sense. Alright, well, there's nothing about being able to take these people. Um... I do try to dive into it and see if there's anything about it anywhere, but uh, no, there's just no information, which makes me want to just kind of make some info guides for this game, for everybody, just help people out. Two 
pillboxes. this a successful raid. We got a shitload of guns. We even got a Humvee for free. Maybe if we stand right next to the people. And I know that to, to keep the vehicles, we have to have somebody sitting in the car. Now that I understand that, it makes sense, but... That car was essential for digging into their defenses. Do you want to escape from the battlefield? You cannot take other loot and resources with you. I'm ready. So when does a raid end? Right. Is there an enemy hiding in a corner somewhere? And it said that they had 20 guys, so... Let's move. Maybe it's somewhere over here? I love it how everybody is just kind of making their own way. There's a fucking enemy over there. Yes, sir. I'm ready. Get ready. Wait. Yes. Yeah. Get ready. I'm ready. Here we go. Mission completed. We found hostages. A terrible fate awaited them. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six women. They were fucking kidnapping ladies.
I'm so glad that I didn't just leave like that. Alright, let's get the AKM. We've killed them. We've gotten rid of the colonel. <laughs> No more attacks on our home. And not a single soldier lost. Because we've we assumed full tactical control. I'm ready. Place for construction? Yeah. Nah, we're gonna go back. Do we have multiple fucking cities going on? Wait a minute. It said an enemy squad is coming to attack us. But how? We just fucking killed all of them. Holy shit. Look how big this map is. Food base, mm -mm. Marauder's Outpost. Was this place an actual demonstrable? Nah, nah, that's not a. That doesn't really show the layout of the place. Holy shit! Yeah, look, fucking, there's 32 women in our fucking place now. That's a ridiculous amount of people. But I'll tell you what we really need to do. We need to get some of this fucking resources going. And we need to build some homes, like, ASAP.
Open the gates for our people. Okay, there we go. Uh, we've got the women in all of the greenhouses. Hunting house for these men. We've got 14 men now. We need to build about, what, two houses? We fucking wipe them out completely. It makes me happy. Two Humvees, two vans, two cars. Go. What are you clicking on, Galama? My, my controller, controller because I'm fighting the dragon. dragon. Such intense clicking. Because, because, because it's a fucking, fucking dragon. dragon. Yeah, but intense clicking. Alright, let's give some of this electricity shit a crack. We've, uh, we've got quite a lot of labor available to us.
get out of the car. Get out of the car. So it's literally like all or nothing. Like you completely wipe out the enemies or nothing happens at all. We're going to need a third factory. Boy just fell underneath the map. And oh my god! Everything is duplicating! Look, I, my, I'm just, just growing too fast. What? What? What do all that clicking? Ah, what are you doing? Trying, Trying to kill, to kill a, a fucking, fucking dragon. dragon. Reveal your secrets. discover cargo vehicles but we need to start upgrading to get like all of this like house level 2 and greenhouse 3 and all of this shit
Everything is duplicating multiple, multiple fucking times. No. Exit to the main menu after saving because there are guys sitting in cars that I can't get them out. And we just got like three duplications of soldiers. So we just got like 24 soldiers three fucking times. <laughs> and most of them are heavily injured. Oh god, I have to close the game too. Oh man, this game was so is so fun, but it's it's a buggy mess at times and that's that's really sad. That de that definitely takes away from the experience. There we go. Had to resize the damn screen. Is it good now? Yes, it's good. Yeah, yeah. What boss are you fighting, Kelima? Or what dragon? Flying, Flying dragon, dragon egg, egg heel. heel. Egg heel? What? His, His name, name is actually, actually spelled, spelled egg, egg heel. heel. A G A H E L. A -G uh-huh. Does he breathe fire? Yes! yes. What the fuck? Red. Oh my god! There's another, there's another one, one that breathes, that breathes, that breathes blue, blue fire, fire and he's, he's more, more annoying.
Okay, we have a ridiculous number of soldiers. I'm gonna see a lot of Josea Harris's. Uh, there's gonna be a lot of clones because they just fucking clone the shit out of themselves. How long did that happen? I I don't know. But all of these car engines are fucking running, and I'm just trying to turn them all off. Okay, unemployment is pretty fucking intense right now. Um, we have a lot of wounded. We need more hospitals. Two hospitals there. That'll work. And now we have to get food. Because this is a ridiculous number of fucking people. We'll wait uh, three days and get the greenhouses going. The upgraded greenhouses. Build some of the housing. We need like four houses, so mm -hmm. 
one. Left a little bit of space for my soldiers to get through right there. The amount of food that's about to start getting consumed. I went from like only a hundred something people, now I have two hundred. Whenever you fucking mash that button on, it's dead. You produce body armor. You produce... Fucking... Let's get away from that noise for a second and build some more shit that we need.
Yeah, that's another hospital. When you have too many soldiers, how do you convert them back to workers? I don't know, I don't know if you can. can. It's, it's, it seems it like, seems the, like kind the kind of game, game where, where you don't. You don't. Uh, well, you can. Like, when you click fighters recruited. But the thing is, I don't. It, I can't choose, and I don't want it to get rid of my very, very advanced soldiers. Fifteen men and three Humvees is what I'd probably send towards the next settlement. Once we get all of the soldiers fucking healed up.
Holy crap, that was an insane amount of noise. What? What? I don't know what's going on with that truck. Uh, whoever's in there, I can't help them. I can't get them out. They're stuck. The minimap is absolutely fucking teeming with, uh... Behold the horde! Unleash the bullet storm! Oh my god! rest of them just stand there and do nothing? Yeah. Yeah. Tell us that.
I'm sad that you can't just take your already built soldiers and put them on the uh, fortified gates. I really, I really don't, don't see, see why, why you can't, can't do, do that. that. It's an unfinished game. I hate to say it, but that's kind of how it is. What was this game released? What was the last, was the last update? update? <laughs> Back in 2022, I guess. This game is over a year old. And this is a year after final release. Oh, that I would mean, be a fun, fun game, game, but, but it has, has a, a lot, lot of problems compared, compared to, to Dark, Dark Souls and Bloodborne, Bloodborne Sekiro. Sekiro. What would be the, uh, problem? One of, One of the major, major issues, issues is that the bosses, bosses are overly aggressive, aggressive and, pull and pull up way, way too much bullshit, bullshit for the player, for, the player to, for any... For any for players, for players to, handle. to handle. Like, they're, like not, they're not fast, fast enough, enough to, to handle, handle the, kind the kind of bullshit, bullshit that they're, they're seeing. seeing. That sounds like Resident Evil, where the, uh... Oh my god, I'm still able to, like, put more soldiers into the barracks? And I've heard, I've heard, this, this, heard, heard someone, someone say, say the, bosses the bosses are as fast, fast as, as the boss of Sekiro, Sekiro but, the but the players are fast as, as the players player in Dark, Dark Souls. Souls. I mean, the Dark Souls characters are pretty fast. I meant, I meant like, like the, the combat, combat is usually, usually on average, average slower. slower. And Sekiro, Sekiro the, the person, person you're playing, playing as, is much, much faster. faster. The, 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 the combat in Sekiro is way, way more aggressive than, than the combat in Dark Souls. Souls. Oh, okay. I can't. Yeah, there's uh, somebody that's injured in that driver's seat, but I I literally cannot do anything about it. And they just fucking replicated themselves. You want to hear each end game? Fucking start doing multiplication. <laughs>
What the fuck? I gotta send you this. this. <laughs> Today, today Gus Ur, Ur, AI, AI voice. voice. It's, it's Dagos Ur. He's, he's, I think, think the antagonist of, 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 of uh, Elder, Elder Scrolls of Elder, Elder Scrolls, Scrolls Morrowind. Okay, let's see the size of this uh, greenhouse three. Ooh, that's, that's pretty. It's pretty chunky. Or just is getting fucking consumed immediately. an event. Food. Ignore it. You fucking idiot.
Josea Harris clones. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Oh my god, there's Carson Stewart clones. That would take a lot of fucking steel. wall
freezing. We got plenty of workers. Pile of scrap metal, don't want it. Stone. Turning off that pursuit shit. Let's use the church. What are you guys doing?
Everybody goes full auto. There we go.
on. This is Colonel Madison's army again. Didn't we just wipe them out? I'm pretty sure we killed all of them. gonna get that stone this is some really aggressive expanding but we have so many fucking soldiers I don't think that it's a problem Oh shit, Lucas Murphy, SG-3000, accuracy 2000, uh, no, I'm sorry, accuracy 50. So that definitely was a sniper rifle, its range is 2500. Oh shit, we got more laws. Intimidation laws. Alright, reduces the strength of the raids and makes them come less often. We need that. have anything going with like cargo vehicles. I don't even know how to use them. I'd love to, but no idea what the fuck they're on about.
and we turn it this way. Please no. Let me get the damn wall.
Barracks, barracks, barracks. Build another barracks. So they can stop running so damn far. Ah, oh, here it is. Frame rate, scrap metal, ignore it. Finally, he's able to get out of the damn car. It's been a while. He's just sitting in that damn car forever.
We are expanding like crazy to get stone. I've learned how to use the walls. You don't want to... You don't have to, like, fully encase every building 100% as a wall. And the walls, you can shoot through them. There's, like, holes in the wall everywhere. We got, what we got? Piglets? How many new frontier bucks do we have? A lot! <laughs> Alright, sell my old helmets and shit. Give me all those piglets. Porridge. M21. AK-12 drum mags. We have only one RPG rocket. I still don't know what the fuck you use that dynamite for. We'll figure that out someday. Porridge, meat. Meals for 26 people, huh? Oh shit. Get the good guns, and our soldiers will use them. Ready. Ready. going on small group of survivors send them out
Having this many soldiers lets us be really fucking aggressive about expanding, which is cool. There's the other barracks. Uh, so many laws that we can adopt. So many things that we can do.
Speaking of something not working, uh, how's some factories coming along? Because we are not producing. That gate, one down that gate. Weapon in the gun shop, we'll ignore that. Oh my gosh, all of the meat and porridge that I just bought was it's gone. <laughs> that was like fucking $5,000 worth of meat and porridge.
Um, research. Ah, right. So we finish researching all of the housing benefits that we can. I genuinely don't mind trading for all of my guns and stuff. I mean, I'm happy to produce uh, helmets and body armor, but buying the guns is... It's, it's simple enough. It's also not like we can't just... We can't really trade for much of the other stuff. very beneficial to do so. woman to the garden. We've gotten to the point where we just sped up time, huh? I just had to imprison one of my high-ranking soldiers. <laughs> oh, I know why we had a random unemployed lady. She, uh, she got put in prison for doing something, but now she's out. Nope. 
everybody stays. Random guy that's unemployed. house somewhere for the medics to live putting the body armor on and everything. Half the UI is fucking blocked, can't see the mini map.
Man, look at him pouring out of the church. Very few trees left there. Plenty of trees. <laughs> What's wrong, Kalima? What? what? What's up? What's wrong? I'm not, I'm not saying, saying anything. anything. Saying what? what? That, that was the point. You just said. <clears throat> The I was oh, just thinking, thinking about, about thinking, thinking about, about where to go, go next, next in this place. place. That reminds me of Dante's Inferno. <laughs> Part of their their sales pitch was to write "Go to Hell." <laughs> go, go to, to hell. hell. There's some ammo just sitting right there. And MP5K. Cool. Nice fucking fences and walls. Right, once we get that military training for our soldiers, I'm gonna call it a day for the stream.
Small group of survivors, go get them. All three factories just pumping out body armor. Still not enough. Some dudes don't even have armor. Everybody's got a fucking helmet though. So that's a good positive. getting colder. I should probably dismantle some of these houses and rebuild them.
Oh, so that's how I can get more people. You gotta put them in the ba barracks, and then you gotta take them back out of the barracks. And then after doing that, you gotta put them to work. And then add to the barracks again. Here we go, now we got some production going. This is what we needed, not 800 billion fucking soldiers. factory produces products faster reduces the coal consumption you need that I think I'm gonna call it a day here holy crap yeah, yeah, you've been, you've been going, going on, on for a while. Ah, <laughs> no. Alright, well, that's it. Good again. That was a ridiculous bug that went in my favor as well. <laughs>